you know, for the most part, I, I felt that I accomplished <laughs> what I wanted. Uh, my last lesson with Diane was a few weeks ago. And actually, I was feeling a little bit of a setback that day. And Diane and I talked a lot about the issue of stickiness. And what to do when you, on a day when you feel your voice is sticky, whether from weather or from whatever. And I went home and just had this kind of aha moment about it and said, well, the environment I may not be able to alter, but I'll show you. I brought this because I'm really excited about it. This might look funny at first, but it's really very, very helpful. What if I could think about my airway as being as open as the core <laughs> of these paper towels. I love and I have been thinking about that ever since. I feel that, you know, it's it's really helped with this aria. Um, the other thing I was able to do is this. The, the, the hardest parts are the very first note, echo, behold, see. And just this morning, I realized, you know, that note's in another song. And it's so easy in that other song. So just, you know, use a transferable skill here. The other thing that Diane and I worked on a lot was that short, low section. And that I felt great about. The, the, Good. We've got a really, I got a better blend of this rock is chest. Um, usually the end I can hold longer, but you know, in the throes of performance anxiety, I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. So anyway. What, what kind of feedback would you like? I, I'd like to know if despite the foreign language, if, if it came, if you got the message. The story. Oh, I think very expressive, extremely expressive, and you know um, exactly where you want to be and how you want to get there. And you, you, you know, you, from the from the minute you start, you know exactly where you you want to be and your how you're going to produce that sound and how it's going to be. And that's that's really that's really important. <laughs> that's beautiful. I thought it was incredible. I thought that the entire time I could totally, totally, I could feel the joy. Like I couldn't stop smiling the whole song. I just felt like the joy in your voice, even though I understood none of it. I felt like I did understand it because your expressions like conveyed the entire song. It was beautiful. Did it help having the translation ahead to know what kind of you're listening to? Yes, as a frame, right? okay. it did. But I feel like if I didn't have the translation, I still would have been able to understand it. Excellent. Taylor. Um. I thought that you were really, 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 really good, and like, like um, she said, like even though I couldn't really understand any of it, like I could still like feel what you were saying. Julia, just like at the beginning of the workshop when we had to feel kind of the force, I was just like, you were. So I felt the if your love for the song so much, and I remember the last workshop. It was the exact same feeling. You just like embodied the song, and it was it just felt so like it just felt so pure and real, and it was really enjoyable. I do love the song. I <laughs> love the song. Every single note was like really really clear, and I liked that a lot. Good good good. You drew me in. <laughs> very, very nice. Carly? I also love the analogy with the paper towel roll. That's so cool. Like, I never thought of it that way, but I'm going to think of it that way from now on. That's really cool. Good, good, good. I thought you're, you're such a performer, and, and clearly you've got experience. And the way you, you mentioned that you ran out of breath at the end, and yet you still did the motions like you were still singing. So I really didn't appreciate that you'd run out of breath until I go back and think about it. So oh, yeah, okay. stop singing, but you still <laughs> try to perform even though. though. Yeah, that, that is <laughs> awesome. Never, never stop performing. It's true. Did you say there was like a lower part where you like trans? Yeah, like, the basalo de la man. <laughs> the yeah. vessel of the hand. That was yeah, true. I couldn't even tell like the transition at all. Oh, like if yeah. you didn't tell me, I would like, it all sounded so like fluent and like really, oh, it went together you. very smoothly and I couldn't tell and it was, that was really, really good. Nice. Nice. Wow.
Is there anything else you would like to do again? No, I, I, was, I was happy. <laughs> yeah. One of the things I say this every time I get tired of hearing me say it, about Julius, Julie has recognized and embraces every letter of every word, of mm -hmm. every note, and everything she sings is an opportunity for expression, and she doesn't miss a one. She's got them all thought out. <laughs> They're part of her heart. These songs are her friends. Mm -hmm. She comes back and knows them intimately and well, and when she's sharing it with you, it is indeed a piece of her heart or soul, just like we were talking about earlier with the energy stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you. Okay, and thank, thank you. you. Yes, yes. Great. Yes. 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 Yes.